We thought we knew everything about our solar system, but we don't. It became known recently that something mysterious is lurking on the outskirts of our solar system. No one has actually seen it, but astronomers suspect something is there, and it's massive enough to distort the orbits of our outer solar system. One of the major reasons why Pluto was classified as a dwarf planet is it overlaps the orbit of Neptune. But astronomers aren't so sure about the cause of this. So, what do you think is causing this orbital disturbance? Well, we don't know it either. But it should be something massive to have this impact. Maybe a Planet 9. Even NASA suspects there's a Planet 9. If Planet 9 really is out there, what would it be like? A gas giant like Jupiter or a rocky mega Earth or an icy frozen planet like Neptune? Our Planet 9 could even be a miniature alien world stolen from another star. So, watch this video and find out what's actually hiding behind our solar system. Hello and welcome to Astrophy's Weekly Show. Today we'll find out about possibility of Planet 9 beyond the orbit of Neptune. Before we jump to Planet 9, we shall explain to you why astronomers suspect that there is a Planet 9 in our solar system. In 1820, long before Neptune was discovered, French astronomer Alex Bouvard noticed something strange. The gravity of inner planets could not affect the movement of the outmost planet, Uranus. He explained that there must be something big outside affecting the orbit of Uranus, causing the disturbance in orbit of the outer planet. This eventually let mathematicians correctly calculate the location of our eighth planet, Neptune. This is how Neptune was discovered and discovery of Neptune fueled a mad hunt among the astronomers to discover more distant planets using this method. And you also might think that Planet 9 is quite misleading, as all of our other planets were named after Greek and Roman gods. But not Planet 9. Why? Actually, Planet 9 was first called Planet X when Pluto was still called a planet. Soon after Pluto was classified as a dwarf planet, leaving us with eight planets in our solar system, the name Planet X was reclassified with Planet 9. However, astronomers have confirmed that, as soon as it is discovered, the name will be officially given similar to existing planets. But before that, we will have to call it a mysterious Planet 9. Even NASA believes that there is a Planet 9 hiding beyond our solar system, and they have published an article about this. We'll leave a link in the description below, which you can check out later on. NASA believes Planet 9 could be 10 to 20 times more massive than Earth, and orbit around 20 times further from the Sun on average than Neptune, which makes it really difficult to search. Like the asteroid belt between the orbit of Mars and Jupiter, there is another asteroid belt beyond the orbit of Pluto called the Kuiper Belt. Astronomers studying the Kuiper Belt discovered some of the dwarf planets, including Pluto, tend to follow a bizarre orbit that clusters together. Well, Pluto is the only example for having the bizarre orbit. There are several objects in the Kuiper Belt which have really weird orbits. Scientists believe there is a possibility of a large gravitational forest hiding beyond Pluto which can explain all of the unusual orbits of these Kuiper objects. Most of the objects in Kuiper Belt have a circular orbit, but there are a few objects that have really weird exocentric orbits. If astronomers can uncover the elongated orbits, then Planet 9 is almost certainly real. The possibility of another gas giant in our solar system isn't weird. In 2012, astronomers used supercomputers to simulate the formation of our solar system, but their model didn't work out. But when they added an extra gas giant to our solar system, it did. However, in the simulation, the fifth gas giant was ejected from orbit and our solar system due to its immense gravity of Jupiter. But however, this may not be true. It was in fact never ejected or was just sent far away from the regular orbit of our planets. We know planets can be thrown out of solar systems, as astronomers have observed the planet floating free in our solar system without any parent star. Did Planet 9 almost suffer the same fate? During the formation of a solar system, there might be a super-Earth forming and feeding from the disk of our solar system well on its way of being a gas giant like Jupiter, except it got too close to Jupiter and was thrown away from the massive gravity of Jupiter to the outer solar system, where there was less gravitational interference. This is one of the bets for the possibility of Planet 9, but some astronomers suspect that Planet 9 didn't form in our system at all. Is our distant Planet 9 an alien world snatched from another solar system, or did it just happen to be pulled by our sun's gravity? 
Well, the best way to figure out is by actually finding it. But the question is, how will we find out? Scientists observe stars billions of light years away, but what they cannot find is a planet within our solar system. Despite having some of the finest telescopes that mankind has ever made, why can't we find a planet lurking right beyond our backyard? One of the main reasons for this is the reflection of light. Unlike stars, planets do not produce their own light, and light is what enables us to detect the objects in our solar system. Since our hypothetical planet 9 is 20 times further than Neptune, it reflects little to no sunlight, making it really hard to discover. And on top of that, it constantly orbits the sun in a weird elongated orbit which changes its position in the sky. We don't know the actual orbit, so scientists have no idea where to look for it in the sky. Although they have predicted the orbit of Planet 9, but we haven't discovered Planet 9 yet. Sunlight reaching Planet 9 would be 100 times fainter than that of Neptune, making any world that distant incredibly difficult to observe. And its bizarre orbit makes it even more difficult. But anyway, NASA hopes their New Horizons space probe will help them to find the mysterious Planet 9. NASA's New Horizon probe reached Pluto in 2015 and completed several studies and after the mission, it went to the Cooper belt to study several objects in the belt. But why doesn't NASA want to use the New Horizon probe to search for the mysterious Planet 9? Wouldn't it be interesting for NASA to find a new planet in our solar system? NASA did mention, we believe there is something beyond the orbit of Neptune and it would be fun to look for a new planet with our New Horizon probe but the large telescope on Earth can do a much better job than a smaller telescope that the New Horizon is equipped with. New Horizon doesn't have internal reaction wheels and relies on its thrusters to orient itself, so slewing the spacecraft around to search for a new planet would be a waste of $780 million, about a decade of mission time and precious fuel which can be used for another flyby of further objects within the Cooper belt. Well, NASA seems to be fair as New Horizon was not actually made to find a new body in our solar system, but to observe the existing planet. The instrument on the probe is not powerful enough to detect any planet in the darkness of our universe. As of October 2021, no observation of Planet 9 has been announced, while sky surveys such as Wild Field Infrared Survey Explorer, or WISE, and Pan Stars did not detect Planet 9, but they haven't ruled out the existence of a Neptune-sized object in the outer solar system. If there actually is a Planet 9, we can't wait to find out. If you learned something today, then give this video a like and subscribe to our channel. We have developed a new app for astronomy fans, which will provide you a guide about stargazing, help you make new astronomer friends, provide you the latest space news and discovery, and of course, watch our videos. Link is in the description. Sadly, the Astrophy app is only available for Android users. However, the good news is our iOS app is already developed and is under testing. So if you're an iPhone user, just wait for a couple of weeks and be sure to check our website www.astrophy.info for info on the latest space updates. And thank you again for watching the video. See you next time.